we did with sprints, warm up. So just two laps around the court isn't a real warm up. So we did the squares, which made us do all of our different movements. We did karaoke, one karaoke warm up. Mm -hmm. Rotation of the hips and the core, absolutely. Um, then we did quick feet, up and backs, shuffles, side to side sprints, up and back sprints, diagonal sprints, and spider races. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. So then we said, okay, can we keep the can we keep your form, even though you're tired? Um, we found the backhand we could not at the beginning. And what was missing was what? Your arm mechanics or your leg mechanics? Yeah. So all of a sudden we weren't we were getting into shaky positions with our legs. So we had to make sure we could get into this type of spot here, a strong, solid spot with a little bit of a shoulder right here, and have this be our loaded, ready to go position. And then from here. Yeah, we saw great shots if you could get to that position. Or if you could get to the open stance position, we saw especially when you could stick the landing. I thought you did really good. Well, I thought you did good when you did it good. When you did it bad, you didn't do it. That makes total sense. So you just gotta continue to work on getting that foundation with your feet. Then we worked on serves. We sit on the serve. We need to practice what we've been training. And what we've been training is that top swim serve. So you need to get that toss a little bit more behind you. And you need to find the balance between how much spin you're putting on it and how much drive you're putting on it. So you can get the ball over the net, but it does start to have that arc on it a little bit. Do you have to worry about hitting the ball too hard right now? Nope, as long as you can control the motion and you don't feel like you're out of control, swing as far as you can. Because you've got all the spin in the world to control it. And that you'll grow into that. It's like you have a, we got you a really, really, really nice pair of shoes that are a size too big. They're okay for right now, but you'll grow into them and they'll be exceptional um, as you grow into that serve. Does that make sense? Um, finally, on the forehand, just making sure we unwind and load with our core rather than our arm as we're trying to go for more offense. And then we play medicine ball tennis, which You'd want to play every day, right? Of course. I'll take that as a yes. All right. Nice job, Anna. That's all I got for you today. Good work. On this side.